Hey guys, Mixed Media Girl here. So I'm going to do a leftover paint pour. And for those of you who are maybe newer to my channel, what this is is um, every time you do a pour, you end up having a little bit of paint left over in your cup. So I just put them on top of each other like this. They drain into each other and it keeps the paint from drying out. And I'll do this, I'll collect up that paint for a week or two and then I go ahead and use it in a project. This is always super fun and exciting because you never know what you're gonna get. You're gonna have all kinds of different paints. I also have some paint here in uh, my silicone bowl, which I've been using these a lot recently. So I'm gonna actually do kind of a combined technique here. So I'm gonna start with a flip cup with this leftover paint. And this has a lot of, I think, purple and orange in it. It's kind of an odd combination. It also has red, white, and gold. Um, yeah, from the recent pours that I've done. And then there's obviously some blue and green in there too. If you leave the paint sitting in your cup for too long, it will get kind of junky and whatnot. Um, also, it depends on what medium you're mixing your paints with. I don't think that this works with glue. Like, I don't think you can leave the paint in there that long with glue. But I mix my paints with Floetrol and water. You know what, I might not use this other paint. Let's see. Kind of digging this, this is kind of soft. Very subtle, which often I've noticed that too. The leftover paint pores definitely tend to be kind of more muted because um, the paint's been just sitting there for a while. And so the colors have had a little more time to blend together. I'm just going to work it a little bit more. You know, I'm happy with that. I'm actually going to leave it. I'm not going to use that other paint. To me, this looks like a really pretty sunset. It even has the sun in there. This is kind of like a mountain plain, you know. So I'm actually going to leave that as is. I like it. Uh, let's go ahead. I'm going to just cover this corner. I think I got the rest. So let's go ahead and we will do our close-up. All right, this is the lower right-hand corner. So going up, upper right-hand corner. Definitely very soft. This really reminds me of sorbet, I think, or rainbow sherbet. <laughs> rainbow sherbet, I always get those mixed up. Um, going down, lower left-hand corner. Just really pretty subtle painting. All right, you guys, there you go. That's about it for this video. I really hope you enjoyed this. Definitely save your leftover paint if you can. And I will see you next time.